Punching. Okay. One hit. One hit. If they hit me, I die. I need. I need. Do I have a teleport stone? No. Here's a run back to that shop. I've got, the, I've got the best armor he had. I oh, know what I'll do. I'll go back on the screen, I'll start attacking until it's level 3. I'll get more health. And then I will try again! Yeah, it's the first time I've actually successfully parried one of those things. Take this. No. Okay. Yeah, but the bombs don't hurt me. Luckily. Okay, let's see what's. Let's see if you have anything else to do. Actually, that light on four defense, I'll have one of them. Okay, so, that. Uh, so, one of them. Definitely several of them that. Those will come in handy. That, that one and that one. That one of the first ones you need. And I'll also need that at some point. Slimy spike as well. So I managed to get my other one. Your trends. Okay, so that's. Let's put that on. Stop my defense a bit. Lots more things to attack. Alright. You down, bitch. Oh, 
Oh, come on, come on, come on. There we go. Right. So that's... There we go. My health is now 188. Let's go and face these damn things again, shall we? I'm amazed how high you can actually fall in this. Especially sure you don't take full damage. At all. At least I haven't yet. And I've fallen from, from, from fair heights. Again, I, I really hate those fucking slime things. It's ridiculous. Okay, let's try this again. Okay, so game. Uh, quickly, don't use one of them. I do. So yeah, you can eat from this room as well, which is quite handy. So I keep that one, which got the higher things equipped to my health bar, and save those room 20 for when I've only got a little bit. It's quite nice. Yeah, so you can see the map on here as well, and you can pan around and have a look. Yeah, there's a little ledge in there. But the colours do combine, so obviously, where is actually, where's actually the blue, half blue, half green on the map? That's actually a save and a shop, because the yellow is combining with the blue to make the green. Confused the hell out of me at first because I had no idea what the hell the green was. Look! Very sweet. Seen these bits of chat. Don't worry. Oh, one of them's got to go. One of them's got to go down. Look at the health bar. downside to keep doing that. Just one down. Two down. Yes. Oh dear, all the... Well done, Dust. Well, if I did put on tough, that's not on normal, so... And none too soon. I can't believe how hard they hit though. That was, un that was so unbelievable. Tough. I could probably take on another four or five of them. You know, if I had to. And this was there. Oh, thank you so much. What happened here? I, I don't know. We were out here checking the fields when those giants attacked. We've been having a lot of problems with smaller beasts, but this is the first time a giant has ever come this close to the village. Then the first step of your journey is near its end dust. 
The village lies just ahead. Yes, we arrived. That's great. But what now? That has not yet been revealed to me. These people are safe, and that is what is important. Let us continue onward. Will you two be all right? <laughs> yes. I just need a moment to rest. I'm not sure how you did it, but you took down three giants single-handedly. Yeah, dude. That's what we do. Bringing justice to the weak. Let's be fair. Bridget helped a little bit. Hey, who are you calling weak? Okay. Let's move on to the village. So that sort of acts as the prologue, essentially, and we are now on chapter one. So uh, we will explore the village, so I'll show you a couple of more little bits, and then we will call it there, and um, we, we may come back to this, I am, enjoy I am enjoying this game a lot. Hold it right there. Uh, are they gone? I don't hear anything. If you're referring to the giants, I took care of them. They're dead? Yep. Thoroughly expired. They were no match for us. There's an older couple back there that could use some help though. That must have been Oneida and her husband, Gian. Thank you. Uh, we'll send help right away. So you're saying you just happened to show up at the right time, huh? I suppose. Interesting coincidence. If you're suggesting I had something to do with this attack... Whoa, whoa, take it easy. I, I have to apologize for my big friend, Caleb, here. We're just a little overwhelmed is all. What's been happening here? I guess you missed the endless hordes of bloodthirsty monsters on your way in? They used to stay in the mountains, away from the village. Now, they're attacking us on a daily basis. No one's been hurt yet. Uh, at least not until today. If giants are showing up near Oneida's farm, things are far worse than we thought. Speaking of which, where exactly do you come from? There's nothing west of here except crazy old Cora. We're, uh... We are prospectors, and we're out oh, okay. an excavation to find uh, ore deposits in the mountains. You know, gold, silver, um, mainly -ling -ling? prospectors, eh? <laughs> You're certainly well armed for the job. Like you said, there are a lot of monsters out there. <sighs> well, we're indebted to you either way, so go on through. But I'm watching the two. Please, make yourself people home. driving outside my house. My name is Bean. There's not much here, but we do have a merchant. I'm recording. Go around. Thank you. <laughs> Go around the block. We'll be on our way then. So as you can see, you can still chat to most people. I don't know his name's Bean. <laughs> Prospectors, fidgets, that was the best thing you could come up with? It was the first thing that popped into my head. It's not like you had anything better. Come on, let's get away from these guards. All right, Ara. Where to now? You're right where you need to be. The answers to your identity lie somewhere in this village. I know this place, and that's for certain. I'm sure I've been here before, but nobody seems to recognize me. And you, in turn, do not recognize them. Yet I feel there is something here that may yet trigger your memory's return. Maybe we should look around for a bit then? If you really have been here before, maybe somebody will recognize you. That is a good idea, Fidget. Let us meet with the townspeople. I am certain that the next step of your journey will reveal itself in time. Very well. But something... something here is making me uneasy. Like the calm before a storm. Okay, so... We oh, sorry, oh, there we go. So see this little thing above characters is this leaf. That means they have a quest. So you grab some push up. Why, hello there. I'm always thrilled to see a new face, even when it's all covered up like yours. And you have a little chin wig. Indeed. Well, my name is Dust and this is Fidget. 
and then they'll give you a quest to do. So the quests aren't explained all that well. Fitted and dust, eh? Not from around here, are you? Well, neither was I originally, but this is a nice little place. If you're not in a hurry. Oh, where are my manners? I'm Augustine, local strongman. Say, you want to arm wrestle? Uh, some other time, perhaps. We're just passing through. Ah, oh, that's a shame. Thought you looked like the arm wrestling type. You know, I heard what you did back there for Oneida. Great stuff. Maybe we can help each other out? Maybe. What did you have in mind? I have an old friend. A blacksmith. Lives way up at the top of Archer's Pass. I promised I'd deliver some materials to him way back when, but haven't been up that way in ages. Area's pretty dangerous these days, if you ask me. Maybe you could deliver them for me? Tell you what, if you help me out, I'll give you this blueprint. If you give it to him along with these spare materials, he'll set you on your way right quick. A blacksmith that can craft items from blueprints? I think I'll take you up on that, Augustine. Well, wow, that's great! I knew I could count on you! When you see him, just tell him that old Augustine says hello. There we go, we have a quest from Augustine to go see a blacksmith. <laughs>